what it do YouTube you already know who it is as you can see we're outside of the gym what two fitness videos in a row this may be a fitness YouTube channel after all but anyway about to go ahead inside of the gym if you caught my last video or if you just subscribe to my channel you know that I do men's physique I compete in men's physique and in my last video I mentioned that I'm on a mission to build up my shoulder so in this video I actually want to just overview my like entire plan to add mass to my shoulders i'm going to pretty much show my workout show some of the um, machines and exercises in which i'm going to be focusing on just my reps sets some workouts some tips here and there so stay tuned let's go inside the gym and get started all right guys so we're going to get right into the workout so our first exercise is going to be the hammer strength lateral raise with the machine now i really only really do this as a warm-up keep the weight real light just getting those side delts nice and loose and warmed up we're really hammering out the side delts in this you know process to grow our shoulders so i like to start out with this just to get nice and warm after that, we move into our first main movement, which is going to be our overhead press on the Smith machine. And I know you're probably like, why are you doing this on the Smith machine? Why are you not using, you know, a barbell free weight? I like to use the Smith machine because I find that, you know, when you don't have to worry about, you know, uh, stabilizing yourself with the barbell, whether you're standing or sitting down, you can really focus on loading up that machine and really focus on form and, you know, really get some good work on your shoulders, just the overall shoulder development with this move. And yeah, I like to knock that out and move on to the next thing. So as far as range of motion goes, I get into what you see me doing now, which is the dumbbell overhead press. Nothing too fancy, man. Just trying to go as deep as possible. A little bit wider here as far as the, you know, the width of my arms, but the same, same discipline, just same form. Really focusing on going deep and pressing that weight up, man. This is actually a superset that I'm doing. As you see, I'm grabbing these dumbbells right here, the smaller ones, and we're going into a little rear delt move, a little rear delt fly right there. You know, overhead press with the uh, overall shoulder development, straight to that rear delt, just attacking those shoulders from all angles, man, trying to build 3D delts with this workout. So. After this superset, I believe I went on to some strict lateral raises with the dumbbell. Like, so as you see, trying to keep my arms as straight as possible and just really focusing on that mind muscle uh, connection with this movement, nice and slow. I believe I was going uh, up one second and down one, two, three, up, down one, two, three, and as you see, man, this is that work, man, especially after what I already did. My shoulders were really burning after this workout. So I think I did about three or four sets of this. I think I did about three or four sets of everything. So this is really, really, really hard to do, stay strict. But that's where you're going to see one of your best results. This uh, workout you see me doing right here is pretty much the same thing, but we're going one arm at a time, isolation. It's really isolating that side delt, man. I'm telling you, I'm serious about this side delt development. As you can see, you know, you want to position yourself. You want to have that cable going through your legs. Hold on. You want to lean in a direction in which you're um, moving the weight. And, yeah, you're not really going to be able to go too, too heavy on this because you want to make sure that you uh, can at least do 10 to 12 reps. But as you can see, man, uh, that side delt, you know, we're working that side delt, like I said. So these last two exercises you told me to do, those are my favorite side delt movements and the most effective. This is the last thing we got here, is which is um, pretty much the same thing as what I just did, only we're attacking the rear delt. As you see, we're just really focusing on that isolation on that rear delt. Same thing applies uh, with what we just did with the side delt. Really just focusing on that mind muscle connection the form and that's pretty much it man these are the exercises that i'm gonna be focused on as you see i really didn't do any front delt movements because to be honest uh other than the overhead press we have chest day which works our front delt so we really don't have to do too many uh front delt isolation and that's pretty much it that's the workout all right people so that's pretty much the plan i'm gonna stick to this shoulder regiment 
as I stated, I'm gonna to try to be doing some type of shoulder movement, whether it be a dedicated shoulder day, whether it be just my side delts or you know my rear delts, at least three times a week because you gotta get the shoulders bigger, man. I'm telling you, especially for like a man, a shoulder is like the key to the entire physique. You can have a big chest, you know, you can have big guns, big biceps, triceps, you might have some decent legs, but if them shoulders like aren't aren't like setting the bar to kind of like have everything come down into that T formation, you losing, man. So I'm gonna keep on and doing my thing. I'm gonna stay consistent. I'm gonna keep you guys updated. I'm gonna take you along the way with me. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed. And if you did like this video and if you found any value in this video, I really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up. I would really like that. And until my next video, I'm gonna catch you guys later on. Peace out, baby.